you don't have to be in the sun to achieve that summer glow because you're looking at some tools here that will help you keep your glow going. You know what, not just for the summer, but all year, all all year long. Year. Jen Hernandez, we're so happy to have you, your professional makeup you, artist. You know what? Girl, yes. Okay, are you ready for the tips and tricks? Yes, I let's am. Let's, so, let's get to it. We did half of Elia's face just to, for time purposes, but look at this palette. This palette is glowy and flowy, and I wanna show you how to use and utilize this part of your eye, right? Okay. So in order to be a bronze goddess, you definitely have to bronze the cheeks, but let's talk about this eyelid. Okay. So we're gonna go Come underneath the orbital bone, which is right here, the brow sure. bone. Push a little bit of a tawny color in there. Okay. I loaded her eye because you cannot do anything in South Texas okay. or anywhere right now for that matter without an eye primer. This little guy conveniently comes out like this and look, it's sparkly. Oh, is that what you put? That's, that's like the what the shimmery I, thing is Yes, in there. that's what? what I put right on her lid. And look, it looks like an eyeshadow. So we're gonna press it in gently. And that's a primer. It's a primer. Yeah, that's a win-win. Yes, oh honey. And I'm gonna grab a little bit of this golden color. Okay. Push it right on top, right? Okay. On the globe of the eye. All right. Next, I'm gonna take more of a bronzy tone and I'm gonna come in right here. This is called the sunset eye. We want to make it look like it's evading into the sun. Look at that. She's glowy and flowy, honey. And then, for fun, I did a tawny, darker brown eyeliner, and I just pushed it right into her lash line because we really want that lash line to show that bronze glow, too. And so do you have any tips for brushes that people should use? So that this yes. was like a flat it's brush a little flat the tip brush, but look okay. at this one. This one has been with me since my Mac girl days. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that just goes to show the last. longevity. It yes. does. We need a, a blending brush with a tip of like this. The flower sure. needs to be tipped very long. And you're going to hold the brush back here. So we let that brush do all the work and pull it out to elongate the eye. Now, Elia comes loaded with lashes. She doesn't play, so we're gonna leave those there. Okay. Let me show good. you this cheek trick. So, I use a matte bronzer. I know a lot of times people say, well, let's go ahead and use more of a, you know, glowy. A glowy or right. dewy, uh -huh. This one is good too. The contour, I guess, game is a little bit out, if you will. Okay. I said that on camera, I know. It's okay, hey, you um, are the professional. People may we lose their minds. It's okay if you still contour, but I want to give a little bit of a lift here and go into the bottom of the cheek. So how just do you right gauge into the hairline. that? Like so you're gonna you're gonna take your hand and you're gonna feel where your cheekbone ends okay. right here. And the meaty part is gonna be the globe of the cheek. Sure. That's where we place our blush. Okay. Okay. Next, when we're going back to this palette, if you have a bronzy color like so, like this one. Yeah, pants. like that one, right in the center. Put your finger in that. It's so beautiful. Oh, it is. We're gonna sweep that right on top. So you use the shadow. A little bit of shadow. Okay, spoiler alert. Yeah. The little bronzy, I guess, little cute things like this. These are eyeshadows. Girl, they're no all powder. No way. Let that it be. makes sense, though. Yes. They're just in a smaller version. Just a little yeah. tinier version. Press it into the tip of the nose, on the bridge here, and on the chin. And you've got a glowing goddess gig. That Look is at so this. beautiful. Okay, what is that? This is a, by NYX, it is an all-nighter eyeliner. I is just, that blue? It's blue, <gasps> green. We're I gonna, just realized she had that under her eye. Yes, wow. and that's gonna add a little bit of fun to the goddess glow. Okay. I wanna show people how to use the scarier colors yes. so that they're not so scary and that we can use them in a fun way and be fun for the summer. This look could even take you into the fall. Yes. Love it. Into the day or the night. Into the day or the night. Next, I wanna talk about this. This is my secret weapon. I got this at a beauty supply. I use a loose powder after my foundation and I just pat it like so into the skin. This is gonna keep that bronzy glow and also let the skin, the makeup emulsify onto the And this is the, the loose face. powder you're talking about, right? Yes, it's the Secure the Blur by Patrick Star. <gasps> okay. Speaking of Patrick, yeah. <laughs> this is our favorite setting spray. It's a little bit of an aerosol. You don't want you to put it into your eyes. Don't. If you hit your eyes, don't. It's not me. Okay? It's not you. You warned them. We're gonna pull away and we're gonna spray this to keep that glow lasting all day. I will put this on a bride and it'll be 18 hours. I've She's heard like, it's really I'm on the good. plane. Yeah. Yes. My last secret weapon I want to talk about is Aquaphor. Aquaphor. I, just go with me, okay? Yes. I put this under Elia's eye. It takes away at least 10 years, even though Elia's like 20. It's fine. Uh, this right here will hold on to that concealer under the eye. It also acts as a little bit of a brightener when you put on your concealer. It's my secret weapon I can't for the wait summer. To, you know me, I'm gonna go immediately. I'm that person who sees one thing and has to go get it. Girl, you can get yes. that at your local CVS, Walmart, wherever they sell it. It has to be the stick, it can't be this. You can use this 
a little I bit have on this. Yes, you can put that under your makeup. It's oh. kind of a Marilyn Monroe old Hollywood trick. Okay. And it holds on to your foundation and it gives you a nice little glow too. Okay. Love Whoa. these tricks for the I summer. I love it all. And people are going to love you, so they're going to want your information. Okay. How can they reach out to you? You can find me on Instagram at Jencita Florecita. I know you love that name every yes, time, right? I so That's do. my little grandma name. So you can find it there on IG. You can DM me. I do classes. I will come and teach you how to do all the tricks in the trade. I love it. You are so wonderful. You look Thank beautiful, you. Elia. She's ready to go chase the sunset yes. and the delicious, maybe adult <laughs> beverages that go with it, you know? Mm, yeah. Enjoy so much. Thank that. you for being with us, ladies. You